What is going on everyone? My name is Benjamin Nock with the Smallmouth Experience and this is my second video in the Buyer's Guide series. And I'm going to be releasing videos in the Buyer's Guide series two times a week, every Tuesday and Thursday, all winter long, going into February, um, helping you guys gear up for next bass fishing season. So this video here, what's interesting about this is it's actually not directed towards fishermen. It's directed towards those people that want to buy gifts for the fishermen and women in their lives. It's, it's kind of generic or more kind of surprise oriented gifts for people that don't want to go out and buy specific crankbaits or specific reels or rods. Um, you can get these people these gifts that they'll love, be able to use next season um, to go out and catch some big bass. Now, the first one that I'm going to talk about is kind of an obvious option and that is a subscription based box. Now, subscription boxes are really cool because you pay each month for a box to show up at your house with a bunch of baits in it. But what makes Monster Bass so special is it's not just random baits. We're hand selecting baits based on where your loved one or you live and fish each month. So if you live in the Midwest, you're gonna get baits that work in the Midwest for the month that you're fishing. But what we're doing that's also really cool is throughout the winter, we're doing themed boxes. So December, for example, is an iCast box, a new product box. So all that you're getting in this box are brand new products that were released this year. For example, the iCast Freshwater Lure of the Year was the Lunker Hunt Spider, so we put that in the box. We also have some other brand new, well, all brand new baits for this season that came in the December month Monster Bass box. For January, we are doing a Strike King exclusive or Strike King only box where you're going to have baits like the Thunder Cricket and other baits from Strike King. And then February, we'll have a Jason Christie hand-picked box. And Jason Christie is a Major League Fishing Pro. Um, so just super high quality baits, hand selected for where you fish, when you're fishing. So they're not going to get a bunch of junk in these boxes. So also Monster Bass is running a promo all December long. Get your very first box for $8 using code DEC, the number eight at checkout. So you can get your first box for $8. Um, it's a really good opportunity to get a bunch of baits, typically around $50 worth of baits for $8. Another option, if you don't want to go with the Monster Bass box, if you don't want a subscription style box, is from a company I'm not, I'm not sponsored by, not even really affiliated with, and that is Sixth Sense. Um, I was doing a little bit of looking around. Sixth Sense makes products that I use uh, year in, day in, day out. Anytime I'm on the water, there's Sixth Sense products tied on, on my boat. And so they're running this sale called the Mega Super 6 box. And it is a single box that you buy. I believe it's $54. And uh, it has six or seven baits in there that are super high quality. You get the Crush 75X flat, which is a flat-sided crankbait. You get a square bill crankbait. You get a lipless crankbait in a red color, which is perfect for early spring fishing or any time that you're fishing around grass or for smallmouth. Um, you're getting baits that are really, really high quality for $54. Bucks, and you're getting... A little bit discount over if you just go out on the Sixth Sense website or Tackle Warehouse and buy those baits. So that's another recommendation. I'll have a little link um, going to all of this stuff down in the description below, as well as some pictures that'll pop out to show you guys some of these options. And then finally, if your fisherman is a soft plastics fisherman through and through, and really a largemouth fisherman, and you want to buy them some baits, the Gambler Lures Gear Up Box is an awesome solution. They basically took all of their hottest selling products, Gambler Lures, um, and put them into this gear up bag, which is basically a waterproof style bag full of a ton of soft plastics that are going to go out and catch giant fish. And it's Gambler's top selling products from the year. You're going to get swim baits, you're going to get craws, you're going to get flipping baits, um, tons of different things that are Gambler's top selling products from this year in that bag. Now, like I mentioned, my buddy Alex Rudd put together an awesome video where he has specific baits. So if that's what you're looking for, go check that out. But if you're looking for more kind of surprise options, things that guys will be excited about, but they won't know every product that's coming to them. I would go with a subscription style box or a, um, I guess, box of baits like the ones I just mentioned. And now we're going to move into something that I really kind of gained a lot of confidence in this season, and that is the clothing that I'm wearing. And that sounds dumb. You're like, Ben, what do you mean you gain confidence in the clothing you're wearing? Well, before I would just wear like random sun shirts, like I'd buy a sun shirt here and a sun shirt there, and some would fit right, some wouldn't. Um, and they really didn't do anything that special but a company that I started working with is Aftco. Now this is a style of shirt that I wore day in and day out from May until October and it kept me um, protected from the sun, comfortable on the water and just did a great job every time I wore this hoodie and this is actually the Jason Christie 
Aftco sun shirt, sun hoodie. Now the reason I like this over traditional sun hoodies is the fact that it has a zip up face shield right here. So it zips up and then it basically just covers everything except your glasses and the top of your hat. So what that allows you to do is run down the lake at full speed with only this much of your face showing. This is also really nice on really, really um, sunny days when you don't want to get sunburned and you don't want to put on a ton of sunscreen. It covers all your arms, your whole body, well, down to your waist, and your whole face. So you don't really have to cover up that much with sunscreen. I also wear sun gloves, the Fish Monkey sun gloves, just for fun. I'll leave those in the description as well. But this Jason Christie sun hoodie is something that I absolutely loved this season. Super nice material. Um, I believe it's SPF or UPF 50 rated, so it basically is going to keep you protected better than most sunscreens would, and it's something that kept me comfortable all year long. I literally wore that in almost all of my videos all season long up until October. And then once those colder, colder or cooler months started kicking in, I switched over to the AFCO Reaper hoodie, um, which is something that is another amazing piece of technology and clothing. What I like about this is it's fleece lined, so it's going to keep you really warm on those cooler, cooler, colder days, but it also has a face shield as well. So a lot of shirts will just kind of cut down. Um, your face is open. You have to wear a scarf or something over your face. Well, this has that built in. I use it more like a turtleneck where it just comes up to my chin, but while I'm running, I can pull it up over my face as well. It has little laser cut holes in the face, um, just something that will keep you warm. It's windproof, it's weatherproof, and it has fleece lining. So it's a great piece of technology that will keep you warm all winter long. And I wore this anytime it was cold out. From October till the last day of fishing last week, from 50 degrees to 25 degrees, I was wearing that Reaper hoodie. Uh, it's an awesome piece of technology. And it keeps me from layering up. Before I would put on like two hoodies, um, but now I'm just putting on the Reaper hoodie on top of a couple of other base layers. And it keeps me warm all day long. Now let's touch on something that has become a necessity in my boat or is a necessity in my boat every time I go fishing. And this is something I'm really going to recommend um, and encourage you guys to go check out. That is an Onyx Impulse Insight A24. This is an auto inflatable life jacket. Every time I'm on the water, whether I'm on a kayak, whether I'm on a boat, um, wherever I'm at on the water, I'm wearing this life jacket. The Impulse A24 is a little bit lighter than the A33. The only difference is the size cartridge in here. So you have a 24 millimeter um, cartridge instead of a 33 millimeter cartridge. But this is something that you can wear. You'll forget you have it on. And once you really start wearing it, it's something you'll always wear when you're out there on the water. The other thing I really like is that this tag here, this thing that you can pull on to auto or to manually make it inflate, holds on to the life jacket. So it's not flopping around. You don't have to worry about it hitting your hands and getting in your way. Um, just a super comfortable life jacket. It's a little bit expensive, but this is a piece of equipment I really recommend if you have a loved one in your life that likes to fish. You also have this D-ring right here where you can hook your kill switch to on the boat when you're running. Um, also recommended. This is a, a big upgrade over the traditional a24 life jacket, super comfortable, stays out of your way. You can wear it every time around the water and it'll keep you safe. As you guys can tell, I've worn it a lot. Go check out my Instagram, go check out my YouTube. It's on in every single video where I'm out there on the water fishing. So two more gift ideas are both smallmouth specific apparel ideas. And these are really cool pieces of apparel. The first one is a smallmouth patch hat from my buddy Nate Carnes. Now this is the same hat that I wore a couple years ago for the entire season. It's a hat, basically a traditional hat with a smallmouth patch on the front of it. He also is making a new one, which is a flannel hat with a smallmouth patch. It's actually the one that my buddy Alex Rudd is wearing in his Christmas video. It's super cool design. Um, they're both really cool pieces of apparel if you have smallmouth fishermen in your lives. The other one is another cool piece of smallmouth apparel and it's a hoodie or they make traditional crew necks with a Santa Claus holding a giant smallmouth. It's kind of seasonally limited, right? You can only really wear it during the winter season, but it's a really cool piece of apparel that I think would make any smallmouth fisherman in your life super happy because it's a really cool design and it's from a company called Everything Smallmouth. Again, all of this stuff will be linked in the description below for you guys to go check out. And the final thing that I recommend if you don't like any of these other ideas is getting your loved one a Tackle Warehouse gift card. What a Tackle Warehouse gift card will allow them to do is go buy something from probably the largest collection of fishing tackle, bass fishing tackle online, 
at discounted prices. So what Tackle Warehouse is doing is running a 25 days of Christmas sale all the way through the month of December into January. So you get your level in that gift card. They can go buy Tackle at discounted prices through the beginning of January. It's a great opportunity. It's something that I'd love if, if I'm looking for a Christmas gift from someone. So a Tackle Warehouse gift card is a really, really good option. So I hope that this Buyer's Guide video helps you guys pick out something for the fishermen in your life that they will love for Christmas. If you guys have any questions or comments, let me know in the comment section below. And as I mentioned before, these Buyer's Guide videos will be coming out every Tuesday and Thursday, twice a week. So if there's a specific bait, a specific technique you guys wanna hear me talk about, let me know in the comment section below because I'm gonna be doing these all winter long. But as always, thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions or comments, hit me up in the comment section below. Hit that subscribe button if you love smallmouth content. And as always, take care, tight lines. God bless. Pursue passion.